the reason why, really, I don't think there's an age on men when they find love. I, for, I just think it's the right woman. When she comes along, they want to change. Mm. That's why I put like 55. It might be 60. Um, there's no age on that. But I do believe in far as your worth, meaning you don't have to be old to know what your worth is. I was like this at 19 and 20. And when they go about, you know, if a man is older, he wants a younger girl, um, he wants a pushover because she doesn't know anything. I need a man, a pushover, a man a pushover. who's going to lead me. And I was like this at 19. I was like this at 20, 21, 22, because my father, who's a leader, who let my mom, who's been married for 43 years old, he instilled that into me. So there is a difference. So, yeah, I don't I'm not even attracted by men who I say prey on younger women to their benefit. That's a turnoff to me. Mm -hmm. And it has nothing to do with age. I feel like any woman who, um, if they knew their worth, would understand I have a voice. I am a woman. It's not about me cutting you off or being disrespectful. It's about a man being a leader and not being intimidated by whatever it might be. (laughs) You know, so I I do get a little irritated when I hear that whole age thing. We want a younger girl. We want a younger girl because that's a weak man. Yeah, yeah, that weak, that's a walk. weak man. He doesn't weak. want the battle. I do also <laughs> agree that yes, a woman should okay. allow a man to have a voice. I struggle with that. I was married and I'm now divorced. I had to learn that to not be so in his face and pointing fingers and trying to break him down. That was my yeah, nigga. right. That was me. Right. right. So now I understand how that feels. Like let me just calm down, and I found ways to be able to communicate to him like he's a man. All right. Let me ask you a question. Um, so you think a guy that wants a woman that's younger is once a pushover? Absolutely. That's that's how you what you just said to me is how that sounds to me. Okay. Do you want a man that's taller than you? Do I want a man that's what? Do, would you, if given the chance, would you prefer a man that was taller than you? That's taller than me. Yes. It doesn't really matter to me. About Preference height. wise, yes. Sure? Preference wise, my height. Yeah. Okay. Bare minimum, right? Or if not minimum. taller. If would not you taller. want a guy that's stronger than you physically? Absolutely. He needs to be able to protect me. Okay. Would you want a man that's uh, makes more money than you? Um, yes, preferably, okay. but if he's there and he has the okay. will to go, we could so do it together. Would you, would you want a man that is more competent than yourself and has more experience than yourself? No, I need a man that's willing to learn. He doesn't always have to know everything. Yeah, that's, but that's he, me. Should, he, should he be more co- more competent than yourself? Because you said you want a man that's a leader, correct? Yes. Okay. But the competent and being a leader, that doesn't, that's not the same thing. You can't His lead knowledge, if you're not competent. Well, on some things, it depends on what we're talking about. But so overall, you want him to be the leader most of the time, correct? I will. Lo- he's, that's his role as a man. Okay. To be a leader. Okay. That what is, if, what if, uh, so these are your preferences, correct? Yes. And I would argue most women probably want these things, right? Yes. Mm-hmm. What if I said women that want a man who's better than a man of your regard are stupid, retarded, short, and weak? And that's okay. That's your opinion. No, no, no. Hold on. I sound stupid, don't I? For saying that. No, you just sound no, no, like no, that's it's, your... it's, It is stupid. Let's keep it. Let's call it spade a spade. That's your opinion. If I were to say that women are stupid, weak, short, and inadequate for wanting a man that's taller, stronger, and makes more money than them, I would sound like a moron because these are hardwired traits that women look for in men, which is natural. Mm-hmm. It's reality. Why is it that when a man says, I want a, young, a younger woman who's going to be feminine and submissive and follow my lead, that's considered being a pushover? That's be- Stop the show. Hold on. See so what I did there? I took your biological wants mm-hmm. and I demonized them and I mm-hmm. sounded like a fucking idiot. Mm-hmm. Why is it that it's okay for women to demonize a man's biological wants and not be an idiot? It's not because you're the man. You're supposed to live by core principles. You're not supposed to do that. You're supposed to be the man. That is what God intended for you to be. You are the man. You are the leader. We follow your suit. You're supposed to be as a man, uplift a woman and get a woman to be on your level. You didn't answer the question. Why are your bio- biological wants and needs not demonized, but mine are? I, I, Me personally, I haven't demonized them. You, you just quite literally earlier. said a I mean, second so, ago, a man that...